45 seconds until Call of Duty next starts. Obviously, we're here for the zombies aspect, but I'm also here to see some uh, Modern Warfare gameplay. I'm pretty interested to see how the game's going to look from a Warzone standpoint, from a multiplayer standpoint, because I do play those on the side and also have a channel going on for that this year. It won't be on the uh, the main MZC channel, the MidZC, for those of you who know what I'm talking about, but for the sake of this video, it's, we're pretty much just going to be keeping the zombies content, and then we'll talk about stuff on the other channel eventually. But guys, I am so excited. Uh, you know, my expectations are kind of low for zombies this year. It's just DMZ zombies, essentially. Uh, I'm just hyped for some new content. I did see some Percolas returning, which will be really nice. Um, see a couple of other things about the game mode. But without further ado, let's jump into the main screen here. I doubt they're going to kick off with zombies. Today, you will see in here all the details of Modern Warfare 3 multiplayer. An exclusive look at Modern Warfare Zombies. Fuck yeah. Brand okay, so, I'm going to basically be sitting here waiting for the zombies information, trailer, whatever I can get for zombies to come up here. Um, and then I'll edit it in. I will be honest, if it looks good, I'll probably pre-order right now and get the ghost skin because the ghost skin, the ghost zombie skin absolutely looks amazing. So this is what I wanted to show off really quickly. Uh, this is obviously the perca colas that I was talking about just a minute ago. These were real life drink dispensing perca cola machines uh, that a couple of the zombies YouTubers were able to use. I think they were actually given out, oh my god, what were they? Liquid death drinks. They weren't like actual like perk drinks, but they were, it was liquid death, which was pretty cool. But this does confirm that we're going to be getting regular perca colas next year we're not going to be getting some off-brand vanguard shit it'll literally be the same ones we got in cold war it looks like this is the staple perk machine going forward we got deadshot in the far left we got juggernaug in the middle and we got speed cola on the right quite different shit. finally from our friends at Treyarch, yes finally finally modern warfare zombies. all right i'm locked i'm locked here we go trailer reveal time let's go Okay. Ooh, is that a new electrical zombie? Okay, I think that's the, uh, the shot that we saw earlier that was kind of leaked. All right, there's the Mimic Hybrid. Russian Manglers are back, but decked out for Modern Warfare. That's actually kind of cool. Juggernaut versus the Zombies. Okay, that's part. these are the challenge modes. Hellhounds are back. Whoa! Is that a new wonder? That's, that's definitely a new wonder weapon. I'll go back and rewatch this and we'll break it down a little bit, but that was pretty sick. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> There's speed cola. Yeah, we knew that was coming back. All right, that dude's back. Pack of punches back. Packed monkey bombs are back. What the hell is that thing? Oh, no way. Oh, my God. Not back from Forsaken. No way. Okay, there we go. Modern Warfare Raygun. Wow. Okay. All right. You know what? I'm going to be honest. For, for DMZ's... Whoa, 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 whoa. What was that? Hold on, hold on. Okay, we're going to go back. We're going to rewatch the whole thing now, but what? All right. Initial reaction. Modern Warfare Zombies, it's just DMZ, so it's going to be like pretty much just, you know, you're loaded into a big map experience. This isn't going to be round based at all, but for Outbreak 2.0, kind of looking good so far, I'm not going to lie. Alright, this thing looks like a giant worm, almost. Like a caterpillar worm, maybe, like a spiked worm drag, I don't know. Definitely looks like a big worm here, you guys can see as we pause and break it down. Is it the pack camo too, maybe? Or maybe not. Maybe it's some sort of Modern Warfare skin. Okay, and then there's the zombie ghost operator I was talking about. Okay, I've definitely got a, got a pre-order because of all the stuff that we just saw. All the content that we just saw in there. Uh, let's go back and break things down a little bit. I don't think it really picked up until... 
right about here. I'm going to turn the volume down just a tad bit too. It's probably already too late if it's copyrighted. But, uh... A lot of Cold War in here, so, uh, you know, we're obviously continuing on the Dark Aether story. This does take place after Cold War, so of course there's our Mimic. Throws you off. Let me see if I can get one more shot of the Mangler. If I can't, we'll go past it. Yeah, here it is. There it is. There's the new Mangler. Looks like kind of a ghost skin, too. Obviously, it's not ghost, but that's what the face kind of looked like there. Alright, so obviously you can parachute. There's the Juggernaut. Is that an egg? This looks like one of the defense steps, probably, since they're all pushing it, so it'll probably be a defense wave. This looks like the one from Cold War Outbreak, where you have to get the ether canisters and launch the rockets. Here's the uh, the Firehounds again, so that's pretty sick. Obviously, it kind of looks mid, I'm not going to lie, from the quality, but it's only 1080, and it's a stream, too. So I'm sure there's a 4K trailer. I'll link it below in the description. We got the gas closing in. There it is. There's the Wonder Weapon. This is what I want to look at. That looks like the D.I.E., it looks like the die from uh, D Machine. Like it has like a similar sort of. I mean, this is the best quality you're gonna get from this little trailer. I'm sure there will be like high res images on this on Twitter or something. But there it is. It's, it looks like it's just shooting a bolt from the DIE out. That honestly looks exactly like what it is. It just looks reconstructed in Modern Warfare, and it shoots that like energy blast through them. It looks like you can jump too. It looks like you can use it to jump and move, I guess. So it's not completely obviously the DIE. It kind of looks like a hybrid of the, the die and the Ray K. A little bit with the way the handle was there. Here we go again. We're going to get some more gameplay. Self res. All right, so you got your. Uh, I guess you can tell you where the squads are, and it's got your the missiles. Yeah, here we go. Speed Cola again. Another look at that. That's great. Reload animations, more zombies, more zombies. I think the ray gun should be here too. I think this is the Tempest from Mauer. This back just looks like a Modern Warfare skin. There we go. Okay, pack a punch, and this could be the pack a punch camo right here. Here's a good look at it. Looks pretty similar to a Cold War skin, but not complaining at all. Obviously, we got the Cold War pack a punch back. Here we go. Pat, this has to be pack a punched monkeys because they're red eyes now, unless this is just how the monkeys are. But we got the packed monkey. This thing, oh man, the abomination, but in Modern Warfare style. It looks like everything's kind of been given a reskin for Modern Warfare, which is nice. I mean, it's probably the same enemy boss, but at least they didn't just reskin it. That's pretty cool. It looks like an ether, uh, ether motorcycle. That could be for the defense step that I was talking about earlier. Here we go, ray gun. Look at your Modern Warfare ray gun there. Absolutely disintegrated them. I'll go through and play it one more time. We'll try and get a better pause. So here we go, it's popping up out of the box. There it is. Look at that. The Modern Warfare Ray Gun. And then, you know, this again. Here we go. It's just exploding them. Looks like maybe a packed shotgun. You versus the Abomination. There it is. Crazy, guys. Absolutely crazy. I'm not going to lie. I'm definitely more excited for it than I was uh, at the start of the day. Um, my expectations really haven't gone any higher than this. Like, I'm still kind of at the fact that it's just DMZ zombies, really. Uh, don't get excited like it's some sort of, you know, out, uh, not Outbreak-style map, but regular-style round-based. Um, yeah, but truthfully, guys, at the end of the day, like, it's just DMZ. Don't get too excited about it. It's not round-based. But, I mean, for a gap year, we're not really supposed to have zombies this year. To have something like this come in where we get, you know, a new Wonder Weapon, maybe, you know, a little Easter egg here or there. We get a camo grind. Should be pretty fun. Should be a pretty interesting game to play, at least for the first month. And then we'll see how content updates go after that. But I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction style video. I think this is the first one on the channel. If you did, be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more types of content like this. Have a good rest of your day, guys.